Hello there, Virgo. Welcome to your weekly May 25th reading. Uh, thank you for joining me as well. Uh, this week, we start the week off with the Queen of Hearts. So, this card, you know, I always say I don't attach sex to my cards. You know, that I always will say that, you know, even though it's a queen, it could be a male or a female. However, this is coming in strongly that this is your mother or your mother uh, motherly figure in your life. It could even be something like an aunt or something like that, or just somebody you consider to be a motherly figure to you, somebody like that. And what it indicates is that this person is going to be giving you some good advice. That's definitely what I'm getting, that you're going to be getting some good advice this week from somebody. Again, motherly figure. They're going to be giving you advice on something. You know, it could be like really anything. Love, money, uh, spirituality, anything you name it. Anything that you need advice on, this person is going to give you good advice. And it's a, definitely advice that you should take. It's It's good advice. So, you know, I'm trying to see if I'm getting anything else off of that, but let's jump to this card. This is the uh, Five of Spades. So this is why I'm saying, you know, normally people read this card uh, differently, but I'm, like I said, I'm reading it as advice because this card right here is kind of like the advice that uh, a mother would give. And you might not like it at first, but it always ends up for the best. That's what this card kind of represents. It's kind of like one of those things. Uh, a lot of people call this card a blessing in disguise. It's like... You know, you you want to do something or you want to go somewhere or you want to get something done. And then you, you, you can't for whatever reason. I'm feeling like this person might be the one that tells you not to do something, not to go a certain way, the advice. Uh, and then you don't. And maybe you're disappointed or whatever that you can't do something or you can't buy something. or You know, there's so many different circumstances. I'm reading for too many different people. But that's what this card means and then looking back on the situation you'll be like oh my gosh thank god that didn't you know thank god i didn't do that thank god that didn't happen because you know like i said it's a blessing in disguise you're going to be happy that you didn't that you took the advice and you didn't do whatever it was because it would have been a mistake uh so that you know that's what this card really means so next we have the two of hearts this is a great card to have. It, it it means that if you are in a relationship, your relationship will be very strong this week. It you know there's going to be a lot of support between you and your significant other or your your partner or you know whatever type of situation you're in. There's going to be a lot of support. If you're this can even indicate that um, if you have a business or you're you have a job, it can indicate support coming from those people, the uh, the people you work with, and it can indicate support you know coming from like i said a lot of other places as well it's a very supportive card it does i mean it indicates a lot of like emotional support and i'm feeling that very strongly this week for you that you're getting a lot of support from your loved ones you're getting a lot of support from you know your partner or whatever if you're single this card can also indicate a relationship coming in um you know getting into a relationship soon and and uh you know all those things and it's a very positive one this card literally represents two people coming together uh, and in a very positive way. So that's what this card means. Uh, it doesn't get any better than that. Next, you have the Two of Spades. Now, this card usually represents, uh, you know, like a breakup or something like that. However, what I'm getting, and I've, I've, I've gotten the same message from this card a few times, is that it's just asking you to double check something. I think that, um, you know, there's like an overarching message between these three cards here with somebody giving you advice, like a motherly figure, the five of spades there with a blessing in disguise. I think that this two of spades kind of goes along with that. And I think it's, this card is just asking you to double check something. If you have to, again, it's Mercury retrograde. That's kind of when this card comes up. And, um, you know, I think it's saying, you know, uh, if you, if you have to sign a contract or, you know, if you're going to buy something expensive or you're going to do any of that, double check. Just just make sure everything's right. If you have a contract, read it over again. If you're going to get a job, make sure it's the right job. Make sure you're not just um, accepting something that you're going to be unhappy with. Or if they have a contract at this job or something, make sure you double, double check it. That's simply what this card uh, what this card means. Next, you have the Nine of Clubs great card to have this indicates uh, a, a good deal of success coming in this is usually something that you've worked very hard for and it's usually finance related 
this this is like a raise, a new position, a new job position. Uh, you know, making a lot of money in your business if you own a business, uh, things like that. You know, it's a very it's a very success driven card. It's usually it's particularly money that you 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 know you earned this. This is something you earned, you worked for, you've been working for it. You're you know Virgos, a lot of Virgos they are hard workers. They do work hard. They can kind of you know put their nose to the grindstone and 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 really crank out some work. So like I said, this is something that you've earned. It's definitely financial and good stuff coming in. So Virgo, I think you have a great week ahead and I really hope you enjoy it.